All right, um, this video, we, we're going to take a look at a situation where we know the endpoint of a line segment, and we know its midpoint. We're trying to find the other endpoint. Now, in the previous video, we did this a different way. Um, we'll show you a different method here. One thing you could always do, of course, you could just graph them. It's kind of figured out visually. Here, we know that the x coordinate for the, mid, for the uh, midpoint is equal to x sub 1 plus x sub 2 over 2. We can fill in everything except for one of these x coordinates. That's what we're going to do. So there's x sub m and y sub m. And we'll call this x sub 1 and y sub 1. So we've got negative 1 equals 0 plus x sub 2 over 2. And we have to solve for x sub 2. So I multiply both sides by 2. We get negative 2, then we can get rid of the 0 plus, equals x sub 2. So there's the x coordinate. And then we've got y sub m equals y sub 1 plus y sub 2 over 2. We can substitute negative 2, and then we can substitute uh, negative 7 plus y sub 2 over 2. Multiply both sides by 2, negative 4 is negative 7 plus y sub 2, add 7 to both sides, and we get 3 equals y sub 2. So our new pair of coordinates would be negative 2 comma 3 in the end. All right, so let's take a look here. I'm going to go a little quicker this time. We would have negative 9 equals negative 4 plus x over I'm just going to leave this x, I'm going to write x sub 1 anymore. Over 2, we have negative 18, negative 4 plus x, multiply both sides times 2, add 4, we get negative 14 equals x. Over here, we would have negative 5 equals negative 9 plus y over 2, negative 10 equals negative. 9 plus 1 is multiply both sides times 2, uh, and then add 9, and we get negative 1 equals y. So our new pair of coordinates would be negative 14, negative 1. All right, going down here, let's try another one out. So we'd have uh, um, x, no, hold on, we got 6 equals Five plus x over 2, multiply both sides times 2, and then subtract 5, 7 equals x. For the y coordinate, we have 1 equals negative 8 plus y over 2, multiply both sides times 2, and see that we're going to add 8 to both sides. And so our new uh, pair of coordinates would be 7, 10. In this last example, we would have, let's see, uh, 10 equals negative 9 plus x over 2, multiply both sides times 2, add 9 to both sides, there we go. Here we would have negative 5 equals negative 8 plus y over 2, multiply both sides times 2, Add 8 to both sides. There's our y coordinate. So our new pair of coordinates would be 29, negative 2. There you go.